is our 1979 Cadillac Coupe de Ville. This is a very special car. It's a Desmarchand edition. A lot of people know them as the Chicago editions. Uh, the reason they are called the Chicago edition is that they were debuted at the Chicago Auto Show in 1979. It's a great car. It's a one owner, very low mileage, 20,000 mile, all original car. Now some things have been done, like the, the exhaust obviously has been up, has been replaced, the shocks and tires have been done. The, the, we went through the brakes because the car was sitting, uh, but body panels, chrome, interior, all original. Here's what's neat about this car, it's a two-tone paint. Cadillac was actually really showing off that their abilities to, to two-tone paint jobs in the in late 70s in their factories. So you have a silver top, black bottom, and then this great red pinstripe all the way around the car. It's also matched by this half roof, uh, vinyl roof here. But inside is the neatest part. That's a two-tone interior. This is all factory 1979 from Cadillac. You have the red insert piping here, the black insert, and the, and the gray outside leather interior. Obviously, it's a Cadillac. It's the best of everything. This option cost more on a Coupe de Ville. But this option cost more than any Eldorado. So you can imagine, they're a very rare car. Not a lot of whole guys bought this. Uh, the story of this car is, is great. It's all on our website. But it comes down to, uh, to one owner who bought the car in 1979 in cash he was a very hard-working Italian immigrant spoke no English and he bought the car because he did not want his family to be embarrassed when they went to a funeral of a good friend of his or to church or anything like that so like I said the car is very seldom used only on special occasions like I said we point out here 28,265 miles on the car as you can see when we first got in all the lights, everything, the chimes, all work on the car. So also put our seatbelt on. We can turn the air on here. Air conditioning is freshly serviced. It does blow nice and cold. Radio works. Like I said, the horn. Here it goes. There's the horn. It does have a telescopic wheel. We said everything on the car from the radio to the gauges, to the odometer, the wipers, the headlights, remote mirrors, as you can see there. It even has a thermometer on the outside. You can see right now today in St. Louis, we're at 100 degrees outside. Uh, and the air is nice and ice cold in here. It's a great driving car. Power seats, as you can see here. We'll show you the power windows working. Okay. And this is our power seat. We'll go. It's independent. The seats are independent front for a passenger and driver. We do have all our seat belts here. You can see they're all nice and clean. Again, I mean, it's a it's a 28,000 mile one owner car. You can't get much better than this. This here is nice and firm and tight. Like so the shocks and tires have been replaced in the car, along with a handful of other things like brakes and, and just general screen up the service. Uh, the gentleman that owned the car owned a radiator shop and had his own service facility, so the car was just meticulously maintained. But even on this bumpy road, cruising at 35, 40 miles an hour, it's a Cadillac that feels like you're in, in your living room on a big couch. If you have any other questions you want to see more about the history of this edition, there's a nice great write-up on the car, uh, along with the story of the gentleman who owned it, and multiple photos under carriage all around it on our website, stlouiscarmuseum.com. Thanks a lot.